Tonight, the presidential campaign trail is covered with mud. Republican frontrunner Donald Trump started it off by criticizing the appearance of Carly Fiorina. Then Bobby Jindal went after Trump's hair, comparing it to a squirrel. And it didn't end there. Here's Major Garrett. More than myself or any single Louisiana person. Governor Bobby Jindal, the no more than a blip in polls America for the GOP nomination, today declared frontrunner Donald Trump unfit for the White House. The reality of Trump is what is crazy. He's a narcissist. He's an egomaniac. He's not a serious candidate. I've met a lot of politicians, almost all of them, at one level or another, are narcissists and egomaniacs. Look, Donald Trump is in a category by himself. This is a man, he's entertaining, he's fun to watch, but he doesn't believe in anything other than Donald Trump. Asked for comment, Trump told us, I only respond to people that register more than 1% in the polls. I never thought he had a chance, and I've been proven right. Do you believe Donald Trump is a man of serious religious conviction? I don't think he's read the Bible. The reason I don't think he's read the Bible is he's not in the Bible. I don't think he reads books where he's not in them. So. Jindal was the second candidate in as many days to discuss Trump's religious conviction. This was neurosurgeon Ben Carson last night. That's a very big part of who I am, humility and the fear of the Lord. I don't get that impression with him. In the latest CNN national poll of Republicans, Trump and Carson were the only candidates in double digits, and Trump's support among key voting blocs is increasing. In less than a month, his support among GOP women has gone from 20 percent to 33 percent. This despite a history of making disparaging comments about women. Speaking to Rolling Stone magazine, Trump said of fellow candidate Carly Fiorina, look at that face. Would anyone vote for that? Fiorina responded during an appearance on Fox News with Megyn Kelly, whom Trump has also ridiculed. Well, I think those comments speak for themselves, and all the many, many, many thousands of voters out there that are helping me climb in the polls, yes, they're very serious. Trump said he was referring to Fiorina's persona and not her face, despite using that exact word. Carson also said he meant no offense to Trump, but Jim, Governor Jindal is happy to take on what he calls the Trump Carnival, a calculated effort to bring attention to what has so far been an attention-starved campaign. Major, thank you.